Hey guys, it's Vanessa from Building a Hopeful Homestead channel. Today my husband and I went to Costco and I wanted to show you what we got. They have some really cool stuff at Costco this month. I suggest you go if you're into prepping, if you're into preparedness, because they have some neat items. So the first thing that I wanted to tell you guys about is this waterproof vintage wearable blanket. It comes, sorry, that's my dog. She's drinking her water. It has loops so that you can, it can like hold onto your body and it has a hood that snaps. So it's really great if you want to wear it around a bonfire or just wear it around the house. It's great for camping. We go to West Virginia a couple of times a year to stay at my family's farmhouse. It has no central heating or air. It's Everything is done by fans or by wood stove. So those will be great for when we go up there. There's also these life straws that we found. This was four for $50. I'm pretty sure that's a great price. So we went ahead and got a pack of those. There's five people in our family, but um, we just got one pack because it's quite the investment, I think. They also have these really nice flannel long sleeve shirts at Costco right now. They're bringing out their fall collection. So I got a nice cardigan, a flannel shirt from when we go to West Virginia. I needed some new clothes anyway. This is a short sleeve shirt. It's really cute. And I got two of these and two of these because there's someone in our families whose birthday is really soon and she's really special to us. She's had a really hard time this year. So I went ahead and got her some matching shirts. <laughs> so her and I are going to match whether she likes it or not, but <laughs> um, I just, I really wanted to get her something comfortable and nice. So that's what I got for her. This is a swim shirt, believe it or not. It's 50 UV protection, US, UPF 50. So I got that. It's a long sleeve. It's really cute. Um, I got this. This is a short sleeve shirt and it kind of dips down in the back and I like it when my shirts have low backs in the back and they kind of rise in the front a little bit. This shirt, I'm not really into patterns a lot, but I saw this and I thought I'd give it a shot. I hope that I like it. It's long sleeve, it's soft, it's really comfortable. Um, and I got this jacket. It's the zero degree, it's a 32 degree jacket. That's the name brand. And I've never had a real, like okay, so since I got married to my husband, I never had like a really nice winter jacket. And I put that on in the store and I was toasty like immediately. So I think it'll be a good jacket. My husband got these workout pants. They have a pocket zipper. A zipper pocket for your phone and whatever else you carry with you. Um, we also found this. This will be great for fall and grilling and stuff and camping. The Rock Reversible Griddle. It's cast aluminum. It's got a ceramic coating that's non-stick and it's dishwasher safe. Woohoo! Uh, but it's got this grill side and this flat side so that you can stick it on your stove Pick up a bunch of stuff. Oh, I had an avalanche. <laughs> and I think it'll be really great because I've found that our family is outgrowing the skillets. Um, we have five people in our family. Two boys. One that's ten going on eleven. And one that's two going on three. And I know as the older they get, the more food they're, they're going to eat. So I went ahead and got that to prep for our future. <laughs> I'm going to be cooking a lot. Um, I got these new baking pans because my old ones are pretty embarrassing to be honest. They're pretty gnarly. I've had them for about 10 years and one of them is still great but the other one looks awful so I went ahead and got that. I got these pop chips for my kids lunches at school. We got this. My husband is watching his weight right now. He's trying to lose 80 pounds in six months to qualify for a job, believe it or not. 
So um, he's really into Japanese culture. Um, and so we really like ramen in this house, but it's made with millet and brown rice. And um, he's all about those grains. So we went ahead and got this for him to take to work. My son really likes these Madras lentils. He's loved them for years, so we, they were on sale this month, so we got him a box. I got a five pack of Clorox wipes because my kids started back to school, and I know, I know that they're gonna get sick. So, I got those to disinfect my house, um, just to try to keep everything clean and sanitary and the germs down. These are for me, I really like mushrooms. I'm a mushroom aholic. <laughs> Um, and I thought this was the shiitake mushrooms to make broth with, like they do in Korean and Japan and stuff, but this is actually a snack. I think they're freeze-dried and they're seasoned. So I wanted to give these a shot. They're really, really low fat. They have some protein, they have good fiber. So I wanna try those. I got these. These are my favorite grapes, along with the cotton candy grapes. Those are my favorite too. Um, and my kids are going back to school, like I said, so I got these to pack in their lunches and for me as well. Um, I got myself a book. It looked really interesting and I really love to read. Um, I actually have a col collection about, of books about the Holocaust, so I wanted to add to my collection and read that one. I feel like it's really important to educate yourself with history. I'm not saying this is factual. Oh wait, the true story. So some of the books aren't factual, some of them are, but I really like to read factual books because I feel like it adds to my knowledge base and it it's a good activity. Reading is great. My kids will see me reading and they'll be influenced by that. We got some Kewpie mayo because they have it at Costco this month. My husband and I could not believe our eyes. Um, we're really excited because it was $5 for these two and usually it's $10 for one of these containers. So, heck yeah, Kewpie mayo lovers here. I got a bag of liquid IV because like I said, my kids started back to school. I know we're gonna get sick. So this really helps me and my kids feel better when we get sick. So I got a bag of that. It's quite expensive, but it's on sale this month. I think it was $8 off, so I got that. My oldest son really likes bao buns, so we got this to have one night for dinner. There's 12 of them in a pack. It was a pretty good deal. Because at my local food line, two bao buns are $8, and it's it's really, that's a ridiculous price, but this is a great price. I think it was Less than $10 for 12. My husband got these wool socks for work because he constantly wears through his socks while he's at work. He walks a lot at work. We got five pounds of the 91 nine ground beef from Costco. I, if I'm going to get beef, I like to get the really lean beef. Um, we don't get a lot. Five pounds usually lasts us a couple of months, but it's it's really good. I got this. These are cage-free chicken sausages, and compared to the other sausages they had there, the fat wasn't so bad and the saturated fat wasn't so bad. So my kids really love sausage type things, so I got those. We got some Alaskan salmon burgers because my two-year-old loves these, believe it or not. Um, I saw this and I had to get it. I love the Bibigo brand. It comes with, I think, it comes with that, which I'm super excited about. But I'm not sure if it comes with that or not. Um, but we're gonna have that one night for dinner. We usually, sometimes we get the chicken from you know the local Korean shop that's like 35 minutes away, but it's really expensive, so we wanted to give that a try and see what it's like. I got this frozen yogurt for my kids as a treat for this month because it's the first month of school. 95 calories per cup. It's a low fat dessert and it tastes great. And there's different colors, different flavors. So 
I figured they'd be really excited about that and I I don't feel as guilty about give it to, giving it to them because it has it's it's healthier um, we got one bag of these gar garden salsa sun chips I like those my kids really like those so we got those tonight for dinner we're gonna have this rotisserie chicken and the Caesar salad and then I'm going to go ahead and put this into the crock pot and make some chicken broth with it and freeze it away. And we also got Georgia a treat. We got her some wet dog food for the first time. I'll just put a spoonful or two of that in her bowl with her salmon and sweet potato Costco dog food. So I just wanted to show you guys this frozen yogurt because I think it's the most adorable thing ever. Look at this! It says G-Day from Down Under. I guess it's an Australian brand. But oh my gosh. These are so cute and they have the little, the little floopy thing at the top. So cute! This is the last thing that we got. It was on a different level of the house so I had to come down. We got a four level heavy duty welded rack for our kitchen. And what we're going to do is we're going to put it together and then put all of our gallon, five gallon buckets on it and all of our jars on it. And my kitchen will be a place that makes me happy and delighted instead of a place that makes me feel chaotic and crazy because there's so many things in there right now. It's really hard to have decent food storage in a townhouse situation or an apartment situation. And this will help. Normally I would never put something like this in my dining room or kitchen, but in this confined space. I don't see a way around it and it'll help us get really organized and, and feel at home here. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and hope you guys get out to Costco and check out whatever they have out there this month. They have some really nice things and don't forget to like and subscribe if you enjoyed watching this video and I'll see you guys next time. Bye friends.